save. And now, all right, we are live. PlayStation. Hello, everybody who is currently watching. How is everyone? We're all on drugs. Okay. Pretend I didn't ask. The, uh, this looks like a black screen, but I swear to God, it's not. It's just loading. Okay, there we go. The high speed driving RPG. Scenario writer. Game designer, Tsukasa Fujita. Music composer, Noriko Matsueda. Chief graphic designer, Takaharu Matsuo. Programmers, all these names. Okay. I'm really stoked about this. Okay. Um, I found out about this game recently when I was on a Discord call with some friends. It is a Japanese-only racing RPG created by Squaresoft, like before they became Square Enix. And that, that's, that's, if you're thinking that's insane, yes, it is. It's, it is a car PG, or at least that's what I call it. That that's how it's described on, on the official box. It is an R, it is a car RPG. Look, high speed driving RPG, racing lagoon, Gran Turismo for weebs. <laughs> Guys, let me know if the audio is too loud for the game. This is this is either going to be absolutely amazing or horrible. Yeah, I heard. Yeah, I know what I said. Car PG. It's a car PG. It's an RPG, but with cars. Also, uh, this is a Japanese only game, but in recent years, it was actually translated by a group of fans. So we can thank them for the ability to be able to play this game. Very excited. I have not touched the story mode. You know, the story mode, high speed driving RPG. Or I, maybe I should read it better. High speed dri driving RPG. We're going to a new game. Shout out to the person in chat who said this is either going to be amazing or like the worst thing ever. They're very, they're very correct. That's why I wanted to play it. <laughs> All right. Create a new save file here, yes. Options change controls? Oh wait, no. No. Should, should, wait, somebody said go to options? Should I go to options? Somebody suggested that. Here, I, I could reset real quick. Somebody said to go to options and change controls. I don't know what that means. Duck station? Guys, what are you talking about? I'm playing this on my legitimate PlayStation licensed by Sony Computer Entertainment Inc. What's the game called? It's called Racing Lagoon. I'll probably up I'll, I'll probably update the the title of the stream to include the actual name of the game. Somebody, yeah, somebody said to go to options, so I'll go to options real quick. Option window. Okay, okay here we go. Sound, one player controller. Okay, I mean like... Shift down. Oh my god, there's, there's actually a lot that goes into that. Shift down, shift up, passing. 
side break, accelerate, break. Wait, side break? Wait, what's the difference between breaking and side breaking? Um, I don't really know what the best option would be. I'm just going to keep it as default. It has a widescreen mode, methinks. Hold on, I want to... There, there's no way that a game on the PS1 has an... There's no way that a game on the PS1 has a widescreen mode. View, race camera settings, message window settings. Yeah, no, this doesn't have a widescreen mode. It's a game on the PlayStation 1. What are you talking about? Dude, dude's gonna look at cave paintings and be like, Oh, I think that we could put this in widescreen. Me when I spread misinformation. Screw you. Okay, new game. Wait, this is a racing RPG? WTF? Cave paintings need an HD remaster. I, you know what? I agree. I think it's about time that somebody remake the cave paintings. Like 4K. Like updated graphics and textures. Uh, overwrite save data, yep. Cave Paintings 2 when? Begin game with chosen settings. Yes. Okay, here we go. Racing Lagoon is like a JoJo stand name. <laughs> name entry system, login, password. Oh, you know, it's me, show. Now I'm going to put in salt. Just going to put salt. How do I? Oh, there we go. As oh, it's a full name. Oh, I'm a wait. Hold on. I didn't- I didn't realize I was doing, like, the first and last name. I thought it was just one name. I don't have an idea for the other name, so I'm just gonna keep it as Akasaki. <laughs> Salt Akasaki, or Akasaki Salt. <laughs> name, Akasaki Salt. Age 18, sex, please. This story is a work of fiction. Oh wait, we gotta read this. Warning, this- oh, okay, never mind. Uh. <laughs> Yokohama, Yokohama, 1999. These are summer. Round midnight. Revival of Yokohama's fastest legend. Akisaki Salt is a certified badass name. <laughs> insane graphics. Yeah, it is insane graphics. You know how crazy this was for 1999? When, when, when did this game come out? Was it like 1999? Yeah, it came out in 1999. This this was insane for 1999. You kidding me? The only man to drive full throttle in fifth gear. Everyone who witnessed his races told the same story. That guy is a crazy driver. But that's enough for fairy tales. Our own story is just getting started. <laughs> the crazy driver and stand brackets. Crazy driver! Listen, I couldn't read that. The night is singing for us. Tonight is ours. 
They're late. Those cocky punks. I'm sick of waiting. Get your asses over here, Bay Lagoon punks. Time's up, Iki. I can't, it, like, it's, the text is going by too fast. It's, <laughs> the text bubbles are baked into the cutscene. I, I don't have time to read them. <sighs> Who are these guys? They seem pretty cool. Whoa, no way! Jojo guy? The game is a speedy car PG. Of course, the text is fast, too fast to read. These text bubbles are too fast. Prologue night, Crimson Moon? <laughs> when they were making this game, they were like, this is going to be so cool. All the people that play this are going to be like, whoa, Crimson Moon. This is wild. I, I love the vibes of this game so much. I'm like living right now. Gotta say, I'm not feeling too lucky about tonight. Yeah, why's that? This ain't exactly the type of night for a debut. Kenzo, throw me a bone. What are you on about? I, I love these models. They, the models look like they're from like a, an old Rankin and Bass like claymation special. Like, you know what I mean? Do you guys get that vibe too? I'm getting that vibe right now really bad. Have you been lin have you been living under a rock, my man? <sighs> Dude, help me out here. <sighs> Kenzo, you see, the thing about tonight is that the legend is about to be reborn. We're gonna race for the car piece. It's like the one piece, but with automobiles. Everybody know the rules? Same stakes as usual. Yo, Icky. Let's see who deserves to call themselves Yokohama's fastest legend. It's BLR versus Night Racers, Iki versus Akira. Time to settle it. <laughs> the style that this game like puts out. Oh my god. I don't give a shit. I don't give two shits about your undefeated record. You're handing over that title, got that? You're finito, muchacho. Are you clowns done talking trash? Let's get this thing over with. We aren't here to show off. You can practice your insults on your own time. This, if this game ever got like an English dub, it would definitely have like those gasps. Don't let them get in your head, Salt. Just focus on the race. Feel it out. <laughs> the the pre-rendered stuff is crazy. Uh, you see Kazuki Kashikawa's grassy over there? We're looting that bad boy. Also, check out my double jerk supreme. Looting? He just starts playing air guitar. <laughs> yeah, looting. He's our rival for tonight. Uh, rival? Mind filling me in on what any of this means? If you beat your rival, then you get to snatch one of their parts. We race for keeps out here. If you come out on top, you get rewards. Get rewards. Oh, it's a high stakes out there. Peep that dude over there. That's Kaseki. He's our mark. If we beat him, we get dibs on his parts. <laughs> He drives that gras C on the in Night Orange. <laughs> uh, Night Orange? 
So try to stay ahead of him, capiche? I'm starting to get the picture. Yeah. So, okay, if we win the race, we get to take parts from other cars. The legend will be reborn. What a load of crap. <laughs> Dude, none of this makes a lick of sense. Seems to me like we're just out here having a race. <laughs> oh my god! Hell, I only showed up to kill some time. These guys take this shit way too seriously. Dude, this guy looks like he came straight out of Final Fantasy VII. Dude pulled up in a car and ran Cloud over. Blow past Keisuke and his Knight Orange Grassi! <laughs> This is awesome. <laughs> this is so cool. Why did we never get this in America? This is the best PS1 game I've ever seen. I haven't even started playing the game yet, and it's already like, oh my god. Now, loading! Okay, so that's the track we're going to be racing on. Oh dang, that's a lot of cars. Here we go. Oh my god. <laughs> There's a bit of an input delay. Wait, why why are they all so fast? <laughs> Way faster than me. I'm going to lose this race. Whoa, oh my god. Man, I wish I knew how to play this game. There was no tutorial or, or anything. Oh my god. I actually know a few people that worked on the fan translation. Really cool to see you play it. Oh, thanks, Henry. Oh shit. <laughs> oh my god. Enough playing around. I'm really bad at racing. <laughs> Oh my god. How do I... How do I go into, like... The gear? What? What? How do cars work? So I'm gonna be in last place, right? Like, that's kinda like... Where we're going right now? Oh my god. Oh my god! <laughs> Jesus Christ! Like, the steering on this is so... Oh my god, it's so stiff! I'm gonna- I'm gonna come in last place. My rival's in fifth place, I just have to make it to fifth. Somebody's- somebody is about to lap me. There's somebody behind me, they're going to lap me. Oh shit. Oh shit! Oh! Go you motherfucker! I'm about to be lapped. There he is. I lost. Now what? Does the story keep going or- oh, do I have to like... Th this is the replay, I guess. I- I can't believe it. My hands are shaking and I'm sweating all over the wheel. The only thing that mattered in the moment was reaching the finish line. Gotta roll the windows down and let the air in. It feels like I'm roasting alive in here. I can hear the cush of the wind, or the uh, the hush. I can hear the hush, the cush. <laughs> Everyone's words are blending together into an inscrutable din. I love this like super badass monologue just on screen right now, and then you see my car swerving back and forth. Like, as if I didn't crash into, like, every boundary. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> what do I do? What? Okay, that's it. 
Did you hear? The winner is Ik Iki Fujizawa. What? How'd Akira do? Why'd the Night Racers lose? The undefeated record stands. Legendary. He might even be faster than the record holder from 10 years ago. Iki Fujizawa, Yokohama's very own legend. The fastest legend is reborn. Voices in the glory of the night. Okay, was I just supposed to lose? What is happening? Regale us with the birth of a new legend. And melt away into the hot wind. What is happening? Okay. Are you having a panic attack? What's happening? No, I'm playing a Japanese RPG. It's pretty similar. I kept hearing that tonight, the legend had been reborn. Everyone's obsessed with it. Hell, maybe I am. <laughs> God damn it. I can't, I can't read it with imposing like that. Guess I ought to take this shit more seriously. I never once caught up to Iki in that race. I didn't even catch a glimpse of his taillights. I was barely holding myself out together out there. Ugh. Kenzo was right. That was one hell of a first night. How, how many pre-rendered assets did they make for this game? This is crazy. Like every, every dialogue box. What? Huh? I wish that when you, <laughs> I wish that when you completed a night in like Five Nights at Freddy's, that that is what came up. Like, night completed! Night one completed! You did it! And then it's like the sick guitar solo, like. Uh, finish saving data? Well, yes, I, yes, I have. This game is around 10 hours of story. If you're good, well, it's going to be around 30 minutes of story because I'm not good. First night, midnight plus one. So, okay, question, question. Question, guys. Does the story just keep going even if I lose like every race? Is that, is that like a thing that I can do? Like, it, does the story just keep going? There's only two, there's only two save slot. If you lose twice, you die. Oh, okay, well, I gotta win this next race. <laughs> I craved an answer. I wanted to know. What had me so shook up last night? Did I just get caught up in the excitement? Ugh. I had to go back there. I had to see it again to know for sure. But it's all gone. The cars, the crowds. It's like they disappeared into the night. Oh, you, you know me, just <laughs> just hanging out and posing next to a fence. You know, this, this is what I do when I hang out. Honey, are you going out again tonight to pose near that fence? Yeah, I'm going out, Ma. It's what I do for fun around here in this crazy town. <laughs> yo, yo. Hey, Salt. Psst. I'm in a tough spot, but you gotta help me out here. I see you there. I know you ring with I know you running with Team BLR. Don't try to hide from me, jackass. I'm at the foreigner graveyard in South Yoko. Give me a hand, ASAP. Look how big their phones are! That thing is definitely gonna give you a tumor. Like no way, no way. Foreigner graveyard. Do we have one of those around here? Ugh. I'm useless with this thing. I hate technology. Fuck phones, man. 
I can never remember phone numbers, and figuring out the speed dial is beyond me. <sighs> Phones are confusing. Ugh. So wait, are we grave robbing? Is that what we're doing? Uh-oh. It's, it's some of the car gang. What are you mumbling to yourself for? You're hiding something? Where's Icky? Spill the beans, bucko. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> These fucking guys. <laughs> With the matching getup and like, like slightly different hair. Come on. <sighs> These assholes. <laughs> As if I tell you. Piss off. You think you got to... <laughs> You think I'd tell you two jagoffs? Ooh, we got a wise guy here. You better drop the attitude. You were gonna meet with Iki, weren't you? The night racers just want to have a little chat with him. Psst, this isn't this the dude that was completely thrashed? Yeah, I remember this loser. Get some nicer parts the next time you lose to me, huh? Psst, Keisuke, it's showtime, let's go! Shh, good luck! You're gonna need it with that tin can you drive! They look like K-pop singers! <laughs> I mean, they got the style for it! These guys could bark all day! Two total losers who get high off of the attention! Is that guy humping his car in the back? What is happening? He's like humping the door. Look, look, he's literally, it looks like he's jacking off behind the door. What is he doing? I kept thinking about last night. It was like nothing I'd ever experienced. I need to go back and feel it again. If I have to fend off idiots like them to survive in the street racing scene, so be it. <laughs> I just saw this in chat. <laughs> passionate driver. He's a passionate driver. Feeling a little bit mischievous. <laughs> I can't. But why? 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 I wanted an answer, 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 answer. This. Brand new feeling, feeling, feeling. I want to know what it really means. Means, means, means. He's putting in the special fuel. Okay. <laughs> Chad is a little bit off the handle tonight. Want to try looking up the controls before this? Uh, no, I'm kind of the best racer I know. <laughs> the like jittery, t the jittery 3D models are home street. This town comes alive at night. The music in this game goes hard and our driving <laughs> brings the heat. Why are they using the brackets like that? Wow, this game was like insanely ambitious, like, whoa. That's what Icky said to me when he asked me to join the team. Now it's Bay Lagoon Racing's motto. If you stick around long enough, you'll find out just how hot it can get. What? Huh? What? A, a park? Bay Lagoon Wharf. There's a, there's like a whole map? BLR, Bay Lagoon Racing. That's us. This is our home base. Our nights begin and end here. Here, I can kill the engine and catch my breath. Bay Lagoon Wharf. We peel out of here to tear up the streets and come back when we've had our fill. Okay, how do I... 
How do I... How do I move? I'm pressing like... Wait, no way! Hold on. Oh my gosh, you dr... You actually like drive in the minimap. Like you're... You literally drive the actual minimap. This is crazy. Speeding bullets flashing their high beams. Their intent to battle. Out on the street, racers lusting for rewards hit you with their high beams. When a hungry hyena marks you for battle, there's no escape. What the hell? Wait, okay, so this really is like a car PG. Like, <laughs> you can, there's random encounters on the map. I got nothing against you, but the night racers wanted me to keep you busy. And it's probably none of my business, but... Keisuke was fighting with a BLR chick by the ferris wheel at the edge of town. You should probably go down there and check it out. A BLR chick? Yuka Su Suzuki? The, the, the ferris wheel at the edge of town? The big cosmic wheel? And Kenzo's at the foreigner graveyard. What the hell's going on? And since I'm so nice, here's a tip. You can save your game at the gas station by Marine Tower. Okay, I just got... that. That's a random encounter. So, okay, do I have to race him? Is that like the... F we have stats. We have actual stats. This is <laughs> insane. What? This is crazy. <laughs> oh my god, we're racing. <laughs> It's like a slime from Dragon Quest just like just showed up behind me and was like, hey, you want to race? Okay, I just got to beat this guy easy or oh, maybe not easy. Maybe not easy actually Okay, I'm gonna focus I'm gonna really focus on this one. Oh My god, oh my god Okay, still in first, still in first. Okay, straighten out your car, bud. Straighten out your car. I'm gonna really focus. I don't want to lose this one before I get to save. I don't know if the cutscenes are skippable, so... Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god! Oh shit! <laughs> oh my god. Go, 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 go! <laughs> oh my god! Okay, I won. I won. I won. <laughs> oh my god. There's so much. There's so much information. There's so much information being like shown to you all at once and you don't know what any of it means. Rewards point. Teslas have good car stats. No, Teslas have the worst car stats. What? You can. You can buy stuff and customize your car. Okay, I have R I have 5000 RP. Uh wait, let's see. Uh this is 1000 RP. Low range ECU plus 7% power at low RPM. Rev limit 700 R plus 750 RPM. I don't know what any of that means. I can change my car paint though. Probably focus on my car stats though first. Turning speed plus one. I think I really want this. Yes. Get that. Okay, so after every win, I can use RP to upgrade my car. Is that, is that what that means? What, what do I do? What do I... This game is throwing a lot of information at me all at once, and I'm not sure I completely follow. <laughs> okay. Oh, is this where I get to take a part? Is that what this is? Low slash mid RPM muffler. Excel at 2000 to 6000 RPM. So RPM is like miles per hour, right? Like, that's what I'm getting from this. 
you can switch parts. There's a whole tutorial out there. Well, couldn't find it. So box air filter. I'm going to go back because I want stuff that helps me improve my turning. That's the previous part. You're cu you're customizing your own parts now. Oh, okay. Yeah, this is this is the this is the part that I literally just got. Okay. Outdated nav system displays upcoming turns. I mean, displaying upcoming turns actually is probably very good, so maybe I should keep that. It's kind of hard for me to see in this game due to how it looks, so I think the, the GPS would probably be good. Uh, switch it out for that. Okay, I think we're good. Can you buy a white van? I don't know, but we'll find out, I guess. Car was going so fast. So do it said I have to go to the Ferris wheel. Where's the Ferris wheel? It said it was like near the water, right? So shouldn't it be like? Okay, hold on, I'm stuck. I didn't mean to select that. Why did I select that? Salt and enlight salty, enlighten me on where I can go to play this. You could just look it up. I can't technically tell you, but you can find it. Very easy to find. Nobody remembers it anymore. The old grimy port, ancient bay. The hush of the night fills the gaps between the sounds of distant foghorns. Looks like I'm alone. Ah, my eyes! I saw the color of darkness. That's right. I'm... an unknown racer. Or so I've been told. This place on the map is very important. How much of this game is a cutscene? I feel like 90% of this game is a cutscene. Okay, I need to reverse. There we go. Like 90% of this game has been a cutscene so far. Oh my god, I random encounter. I I actually cannot believe that there are actual random encounters on the map. That is killing me. <laughs> that is hilarious. <laughs> like what the hell? <laughs> Okay. Look out! It's me, uh, main character guy. You can't stop me. I'm super cool. I'm gonna lose. This this guy this guy is way faster than me. What what is this? Oh my god. Yeah, this guy's way faster than me and better at turning. Oh my god. Wow, that was the shortest race ever. Am I just dead? Did I lose? Like, am I dead dead? Use your potions? <laughs> I lost my ultra filter? You can lose things? You can lose parts of your car? You met a level 99 encounter, basically. <laughs> well, no more filter for me, I guess. Okay, I gotta avoid the, the cars with the headlights. So isn't, wh where, where am I, where am I going? It's the, oh no, 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 no. Oh, oh, that car almost got me. Ooh. I can't believe I lost the filter on my car. Big wheel. Here we go. 
This is where I need to go, right? Go back? Well, can't go back anymore. Oh no, the filter, the filter, salty is too dangerous. What do you mean? Wait, am I not prepared for whatever this is? It's Yuka's micro GT. What's it doing here? I don't think she came here just to shop around. Gosh, I still remember what she said to me here when I finally joined the team. We're going to flash back to the... <laughs> okay, we're flashing back. Salt, we're finally BLR buddies. Welcome to the coolest squad in town. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> she looks like a plastic doll. What can I say? I had some time to kill. Oh, so what you driving? A piece of shit. I don't even have a filter anymore. Whoa, whoa, get a little bit too close there. Ah, I knew you would say that. An 86 is so like you. Oh no, she's hot. She she looks like a, a chunk of plastic. What are you talking about? Hey, what's that supposed to mean? An 86 might have an 86 might have all the bells and whistles, but there's something special at its core. The engine. Yes, it's the engine of the car. You need the engine to go. Make sure you take good care of that car, okay? I really did not take good care of my car. <laughs> You're going to speed past me in no time. Why are people so hung up on speed anyways? Oh, please, don't pretend like you don't know. You know that weird flickering you see on asphalt on a hot day? Uh, you mean a mirage? What are they talking about? This is about cars! We're talking about cars! Yeah, I try to catch up to them, getting closer and closer. Till it's so close I feel like I can reach out and touch it. That's when I hit the gas hard. But I can never reach it. It just fades away because it was only an illusion. So if I keep getting faster, you think I could catch it someday? Now you're getting it. Your car's gonna vroom right past my micro GT and disappear into the horizon and melt into that same mirage. It must feel amazing to finally catch it and feel your worries fade away. What's there to be worried about? Oh, um, about that. Hey, Salt, if you ever reach that speed, you gotta take me with you. I want to see it, the other side of the mirage. I'm not sure I can make that pro <laughs> What are we talking about? <laughs> what are you talking about, lady? <laughs> what? This is insane! I might lose interest in racing in like a week. <laughs> That's got to be the truest statement in this entire game. I don't know, I might get bored in like a week. <laughs> and that's it? That's the flashback? It ends with him saying, I don't know, I might just get bored and stop racing. Who cares? The other side of the mirage. Is that it? Accurate to Derek's personality. I, I'm nothing like this man. Except for the fact that he said that he was probably going to be like disinterested with racing in like a week. Okay, so now what? We go to the cemetery, right? Where, where's the cemetery? Should I, should I grind? Oh, well, I guess I'm, I guess I'm in a race. I, I was, I was thinking, hey, maybe I should grind. And then I was like, no, you're going to be in a race now. Okay, so I'm like screwed. This guy's gonna beat me already. I can already tell. Don't lose this salt man. I'm trying. I'm trying. I'm not I'm not good at this. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna put my foot on the gas. 
Okay, this is a short track. Okay, turn right. Wait, my my car was like drifting. Oh my god. No way. No, no, no! What? 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 No. No, 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 no! Oh. Oh my god. Oh my god, he's gonna take another part of my car. He's gonna take another part of my car. He's gonna take, like, my steering wheel, and I won't be able to race. What the hell? Yeah, game over? Did I just get a game over? What what happened? Okay, it's still not a game over, but I'm not doing so hot. So where is this this like cemetery? What like Where Okay. Car, please work with me. Is the cemetery like on the outside of town or something? Hit the tuning shop, bro. I don't know where the tuning shop is. I just I just pulled up the game. Oh my god. <laughs> I can't catch a break. I I can't I can't beat this guy. I I can't beat this guy. <laughs> the graveyard's on the left side of the map, long street next to the docks. Okay. Left side of the map, got it. I'll do that when I when I get out of this. Oh, this is a big turn too. This is it's gonna be so bad. Okay. Big turn, big turn, big turn. Oh my god. <laughs> big turn! Small turn? Oh shit! Oh my god. Reverse! Reverse! Reverse the car! <laughs> Oh my god! Go! Move! Jesus Christ. Oh my god. Well, so much for that. If by some miracle, I somehow still win- it's not- it's not gonna happen. Never mind. Oh my god. Hey, this is a pretty good time for me to say I'm not good at racing games. Like, I'm just not good at them. And whatever the hell is going on here, I'm not good at it. You had it? Well, listen, I have a lot of things. Oh my god. Okay, I lost my muffler. Funny muffler. This game seems super anxiety inducing if you don't know exactly where everything is on the map. Yeah, I, I got into several races and lost all of them, so I'm not feeling super hot. People were saying to go to the tuning shop. Is there multiple tuning shops or am I going to have to go back? Really hoping that a, gar a car with headlights doesn't run into me right now. Really hoping. As the wharf. One tuning shop per map. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, oh, oh. This is a body shop. Is this a place where I should go? I'll go here. I'll, tr I'll try going here. Sitting under the highway, Maraca Auto Works. I fixed a dent or two, but this guy's got magic hands. He's hard as nails, old man, that the city's been trying to scrape off the map for years. Like so many other garages, they changed their name to English to make it seem more modern. The body shop is for adapting the car to different drive tr drive trains. The tune shop is for actual parts. It's near the Ferris wheel. Okay, I'll go back. Progress ain't always the best way forward. 
Look at him go. Look at this man go. <laughs> if you lose all your car parts and game over, would Pac-Man World Rally be on the cards to stream? No. Okay, I'm... No, 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 I meant to press back. Damn it. This place is cool. You can course, score parts from him sometimes, but this is where you make any car body fit any ch chases. This is that what I want. Man, this is a pretty bad game to play if you don't know anything about cars. Because I'm going to be real. I know nothing about cars. I just selected the... Okay. Um, so I selected the body shop again on accident. Okay, so I'm gonna go near the Ferris wheel and I should be able to find a tuning shop. Also, I'm already saying this right now. I don't think I'll be able to beat this game. This might just be like a stream or two type of game. This is a little bit like, I'm a bit in over my head at the moment. Oh my God. Okay, Ancient Bay. Okay, keep your eyes out for the tuning shop. Because I need car parts. <laughs> this is insane. Uh, the bank, don't need the bank. Governor Street. Ooh. Two shop. Two shop. Here we go. I've enjoyed watching you so far. I mean, like, I'm going to try my best. I'm going to try my best. We'll see. Tune Shop Spencer, it's home turf for B for Team BLR. Some rich guy waltzed in and built it along with the only racetrack in Yokohama. Purely for sport. Hella convenient to tune up your car and then take it across the street for a test drive. Kyoji sure was stoked about it. Rumor has it that the manager here has a 10-year history in street racing. <laughs> it's like... I like how the camera cut to a slightly different angle for the shop. Like, it's very cinematic. <laughs> Jaws drop whenever he recounts the tale of his machine gun torque. So he claims. He's a friendly guy and all, just don't ask him for a discount. This is a certified car moment. Uh, tuning tutorial. Th this is this is gonna be helpful for me. Finally, a tutorial in this game. Oh my god. What's up, fellas? Welcome to the tuning tutorial. I'm Team BLR leader Iki Fujizawa. In this tutorial, I'll personally teach you the basics of machine complete. Salt, you listening? <laughs> I know long lectures aren't really your thing. I'm gonna be asking questions though, so make sure you pay attention. Okay. Uh, if you get bored, you can always press start and scene skip out of here. To become the fastest, you gotta learn the ins and outs of each race course. But your driving skill alone can only take you so far. Master racers also know how to tune their ride for the occasion. Both of these skills are crucial. Makes sense. Machine Complete's got three menus. Engine complete, chassis complete, and body complete. The performance of your car depends on all three working in harmony. Improving your car ain't exactly straightforward, but basically, want speed, engine complete. Cornering, chassis complete. Looking fly, body complete. It's all up to you, so install the parts that suit your style. Note to self, engine, chassis, body. Wait, what's my style? Need any more info? Um, well, what does body do? Body completes where you modify your car's shape and appearance. In these sockets, you can install aero kits, paint jobs, decals, spoilers, that kind of stuff. 
Some say coolness is the most important stat on your car. Hell yeah, it is. A body can change greatly depending on your your uh, drivetrain. However, a certain body is only compatible with specific drivetrains. You can change the drivetrain what a, that a body is compatible with at Body Shop Morocco. You're, you can plaster your car with decals to give it an obnoxious paint job. Not exactly my style, though. I can teach you how to look cool. It's all subjective. Remember, drive safely in real life. Go wild in Racing Lagoon. <laughs> yeah, guys, but make sure when in real life you drive really carefully. But in Racing Lagoon, go freaking ham. Okay, I, I think I kind of get it. Some of the stuff is a little bit confusing, but I could always go back to this tutorial if I actually, like, need help. Really cool to see you playing. I know the translator and he's awesome. Dope. The moment I saw this game, I was like, oh my gosh, somebody translated this? This is awesome. <laughs> Again, I'm not sure how much I'll actually play of this because uh, I'm not good at this game and it does not seem like I will get far. Tune Shop Spencer. <clears throat> you should read the engine complete. The tutorial disappears later in the game? What? Okay. Wait, hold on. I need to go back. I need to read the tutorial. The tutorial is only available in the first chapter. Why would they do that? Why would they do that? This is like Nintendo fan repellent. JRPG and cars. Uh, in summary for upgrades, engine equals fast, chassis equals better corners, body equals drib. <laughs> okay, good to know. Um, okay. Uh, blah, 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 blah. Need any more info? Uh, engine complete. Engine complete is when you tune up your engine, the heart and soul of your car. Remember how you junction... Uh, remember how you junction magic with your guardian force in the Final Fantasy VII? <laughs> Wait, they could just drop direct references? Think of the parts as increasing your engine stats in the same way. We <laughs> can just drop that! What? My favorite GF is Baham. <laughs> what? Just in case you were wondering. What? Huh? They're allowed- <laughs> You can just do that? That's allowed? Uh-huh, mine's Toneberry King. Huh? That- that's Final Fantasy VIII. I, uh, Final Fantasy VIII, whatever. Yeah, the devs were really into Final Fantasy. <laughs> Check out the engine unit at the top left of the screen. There's a few different types of engines that exist, but they all rotate your crankshaft at the end of the day. Terms like V6, rotary, and flat describe how the cylinders are arranged and move. Remember, the parts that you can use are limited depending on the type of engine. The numbers you want to keep an eye on are max power and max torque. Ooh, ooh, question. Why are they important? Um, god damn, this is a lengthy tutorial. Max power determines the top speed your car can reach. It's measured in horsepower, PS. It's as vital as attack power in Final Fantasy or Saga Frontier. <laughs> okay, thank you for the information. Max power is displayed next to RPM, the RPM your engine reaches it at. Having lots of horsepower is useless if your engine can't maintain that it at, ho at a high RPM. The blue line on the graph shows the relationship between horsepower and RPM. An ideal blue line rises smoothly, like the one behind me. Note to self, blue line up, good. Max power equals top speed. Oh, and cool engine icon equals more power? This is wild. Max torque is a measure of your engine's maximum rotational force. 
Love all your videos, have shown hi ha to almost everyone I know. Have you ever taken suggestions for hi ha content? Didn't want to assume and suggest anything unprompted. Keep up the funnies, man. Thank you for the question. Uh, yes, sometimes I do take suggestions. But recently I've kind of like died down on that just because I already have a list of like a lot of stuff that I'm, I'm thinking about like, you know, checking out uh, in the coming year. So probably not. Um, also, sorry about the wait on Have You Heard About Guys. I had to take a break from it to focus on some other projects, but it'll come back. I, I promise. Uh, anyway, Torque is that explosive power that turns the boxer's punch into a knockout. Uh, as max torque increases, so does your car's acceleration. It's like strength in Saga Frontier Final Fantasy. The base stat for power. Do they just assume that every person that plays this game has played Saga Frontier and Final Fantasy? Because I've played neither. And this is this is getting more confusing. Max torque is measured in kilogram meters and is shown next to the RPM that it peaks at. The red line on the graph shows the relationship between the, tar the torque and the RPM. A gentle hill-shaped curve like this one leads to easier handling. Your, t your tachometer is shown above the speedometer and it measures your RPM. Give it a check every once in a while to understand your engine better. I see. Torque affects acceleration, smooth curve, easy handling. Okay. Curb weight. Curb weight is the total weight of all of your units and parts. Keep in mind that the engine tends to be the heaviest thing on your car. Think of it like your equipment weight in Final Fantasy or Saga Frontier. This is not helping me. This comparison that you guys are making, this is not aiding me at all. This is making it more confusing for me. Stop referencing Final Fantasy and Saga Frontier. Why, why do they keep referencing it in every single explanation? Imagine all the heavy gear that Gustav 13 from Saga Frontier 2 has to carry around. <laughs> this is this is the least helpful explanation I've ever read in a video game. What are you talking about? I just sat down. <laughs> Dieting is when you try to reduce your overall curb weight. Cars got a diet too. Lighter equals faster. This is making me hungry. <laughs> okay. Power? Power. Is that a weird... Is that the weird number in the now loading screen? Power, uh, power to weight ratio, is an estimate of how well your car actually performs. It divides your weight by your horsepower. By comparing the two, you can actually gauge how fast you actually go. Lower power is faster. Wait, was that the formula? Fractions, decimal, I didn't know there'd be math. Those F1 cars that Kenzo drools over can get around 800 kg over 1000 PS, giving them a power of 0.8 kg over PS. Uh, my my RS20000 turbo clocks in at 2.5 and a stock... These guys are speaking gibberish. I can't understand what they're saying. The game is translated to English and I still don't understand. I don't I don't know anything about cars. This is this was a bad idea to play this game. Lower power equals faster. I thought I was the I thought it was the other way around. Bingo. I know how to power up. Just got to take parts from slower models like wagon 660s, then move up to the big boys. I'll be unstoppable. Okay, engine complete. Check out the little slots next to the engine icon. These, these are the parts that fit into these slots and improve your engine's performance. It's like using gear to raise your damage in Final Fantasy VI Saga Frontier! Thank you once again for that comparison that I totally understand! Engines have a level and gain XP. After racing enough with an engine, it'll level up. Just like in Final Fantasy! Did you know that you play Final Fantasy? Check out Final Fantasy on PlayStation 1! If you level up an engine, its socket count will increase. So the more you use an engine, the faster it'll get. 
However, level ups can't add sockets to an engine that started without any. Some high spec engines with no levels have no levels, so they'll never need to upgrade. Be smart about using them. Once you've chosen a tuning goal, level up an engine that fits your plan, just like you can do in Final Fantasy on the PlayStation 1. Uh, I think I get it, like Final Fantasy. Some parts improve air intake and exhaust, like air filters and mufflers. Then there's some more specialized parts like ECUs and bore-ups. And who doesn't love installing a turbo? Even a crummy engine can roar once you tune it up just right. Hmm, how many turbos do I need to beat Iki? Neglecting some aspects of the engine can chase pure engine to chase pure power can throw off its balance. Uh, okay, so I can't go for pure power. Well, you'll get a feel for that soon, don't worry. Great advice, but ultimately, race how you want. Okay, I think I get it. I think I understand at this point. Need any more info? Oh my god. Chassis complete is weird. <laughs> I didn't know I'd have to... I didn't know I'd have to study. I didn't come prepared to study. 50% <laughs> of this stream is gonna be me go through tutorials. <laughs> oh my god. Chassis complete is when you tune up the handling and mobility of your car. It's like raising your agility in Final Fantasy or Saga Frontier! <laughs> your car makes contact with the road on just four tires, so make the most out of them! Your chassis contributes greatly to the stability and maneuverability of your car! Oh, four tires per car. Gotta write that down. <laughs> the large icon in the top left is your chassis. Chassis are split into five times depending on engine, location, and drivetrain. <laughs> and drivetrain describes all the components that deliver power from the engine to the wheels. Okay, question, what the heck does that mean? I'm so scared to click this. <laughs> drivetrain? The five types of drivetrains are as follows. FF, FR, oh my god, there's so much! FF, front engine, front drive. The engine is in the front, powering the front wheels. Okay, that makes, that makes sense. Most passenger cars are built with FF nowadays for the cabin space and the fuel efficiency. I'm learning so much about cars. I'm learning so much about cars right now. I have never learned this much about cars in my entire, like, 25 years of existing. This is the most I've ever learned about cars. I, I know, like, a shit ton more than I did when I came into this game. But we don't care about that. Since all the power is in the front, it's got a front heavy feel when cornering. So you end up understeering due to your big turning radius. Hmm, oversteering is when you do the opposite. FF is the most popular type of drivetrain. Okay, I'll probably just default to that. FF? Like <laughs> Final Fantasy? <laughs> I knew this all before joining, haha, <laughs> I'm a nerd. Yeah, everybody point and laugh. Point of laugh at the nerd. They're great at accelerating <laughs> off the steering line without skidding, so beginners like them. Okay, I'm a beginner. Speaking of, when are you upgrading, Kenzo? What did FF stand for again? <laughs> Final Fantasy? <laughs> okay, <laughs> FR. FR, front engine, rear drive. Engine in the front, powering the rear wheels. Okay, that makes sense. They're usually found in sports cars, like the 86 that I gave you. FRs can make sharper turns and accelerate more stably, as most weight is on the powered wheels. I'd recommend FR if you would like an experience to experience driving pleasure and drift like a king. My RST Turbo whatever is a FR as well, of course. Drifting is nuts. I'd hit the railings for sure. Pulling the handbrake is scary. Okay, so I would have to pull the handbrake to like 
drift better, I guess. MR, mid-engine rear drive. Engines in the middle powering the rear 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 wheels. I can speak. These aren't your everyday cars. Cabin space is minimal. Dude, holy shit. Should I be writing this down? Should I be writing this down? I'm gonna start writing this down. I, I'm gonna get out a pen and paper and I'm gonna start writing it down. Hold on. Hold on. I'm writing it down. <laughs> I'm making notes. Okay. FF Engine Damn it FF Engine In front Powers Front Wheels Good for beginners So I'm gonna aim for that FR Is Engine Front Powers Back Wheels and M M MR is middle engine rear wheels. Is that why they have the acronym? So like FF is front front. So it's front engine front wheels. FR is front engine rear wheels. MR is M for middle, rear for rear wheels. Okay. Bro's taking notes for a racing game. We're gonna have a pop quiz after this. I hope you're ready. Its real purpose is max speed. F1 cars have MR configurations. Cornering is also much easier due to your center of gravity being in the middle. Ooh, okay. Good cornering. Good cornering. Because engine is in the middle. Okay, that makes sense. Steering is so tight that the line between man and machine blurs. Tiny errors can be fatal. Okay, uh... The... Very tight steering. Small errors fatal. That makes sense. <coughs> oh god. If you want to come after my title, MR is for you. Okay. Uh, MR is what I should eventually aim for to get the title. Got it. MR, huh? F1 cars are so sick. Okay, so I guess MR is like the best one. RR, so it's like rear engine, rear drive. Okay, I'm getting it now. I'm getting it. Is this whole game an outdated car ad? <laughs> MR is the fastest, but it can be easy to lose control of if you don't know what you're doing. Okay. The fastest one, but very easy to lose control of. Got it. Okay. RR is rear engine, rear drive. Okay, I'm getting it. Rear engine, rear drive. Man, I wish that my buddy Pasty was here. Dude knows way too much about cars. Like, he would love this. He would love just teaching me about this. Because, uh, I've never really driven an RR. The engine is in the rear, powering the rear wheels. Handling is light, cars in Germany and Koro Koro are typical RRs. RR, that's two Rs. That's right, Kenzo. Good job, buddy. He's learning so fast. Okay, I didn't learn anything about RRs. 4WD, otherwise known as four-wheel drive. Power from the engine is distributed to all four wheels. Okay, I actually know this one. Four-wheel drive. Four-wheel drive. Power is distributed to all four wheels. This, this one's really good for, like, snow. Like, if it starts snowing out, or, like, you need to, like, get up a really big hill. Some call it by 4x4. Four by four. It does great on rough terrain and can overcome the disadvantages of each 2WD layout. Too bad it's nothing special in terms of raw performance. You also need to worry about understeering, because all four wheels have extra inertia. 
Whoa, 4WD, power on every wheel. Kenzo, can you shut up? You're not helping me at all. Okay. Let's look at the uh, chases, chassis parameters. They're not as important as the engine numbers, but let's talk about the chassis parameters. Oh my god. Oh my god. Kill me. Kill me. When I started playing this game, I didn't think I'd have to learn about cars for two hours. Oh my god. Wheelbase is the distance from the front to the re rear wheel. Okay. Oh. Hold down. <laughs> Gotta write this down. Distance from the front to rear wheel. Why do, now, why does this matter? The longer, the better stability on straightways. The longer it is, the better stability on straightways. Straightaways. Okay. Wheelbase. But what's it based on? Kenzo, please, I don't care about your little stupid funny jokes. I'm trying to learn about cars. Track is the distance. Hold on. Track. The distance between the left and the right wheels. Distance between left and right wheels. The distance can be different in the front and the rear. Wider track equals better cornering. Wider track equals better cornering. Good. In parentheses. <laughs> oh my god. Salty, you don't need to learn about cars. Just do what I do and replace parts whenever they break. Use YouTube tutorials and refill brake fluid <laughs> and refill the brake fluid every Saturday because I'm too lazy to fix it. Okay. Ground clearance. Ground clearance. Okay, I'm going to guess what this one is. I'm not looking at the screen. I think it's how much ground the car takes up, like how much surface area the car takes up on the ground. Ground clearance is the distance from the ground to your... Oh, no, I was completely wrong. Uh, okay, so space between... Cars, body, and ground below. A lower center of gravity improves stability. Lower center of gravity improves stability. Got it. <laughs> yeah, if it was the driver's height, I'd most likely be the most stable in BLR. The dr okay, so... Wait, is Kenzo saying that... I thought the low center of gravity meant... If... if it, wait, so is it better if it's higher off the ground, then? Quickly, somebody in cars, tell me. Tell me. Is, is it better when it's closer to the ground? If it was driver's height, I'd be the most stable. Oh, it's because, it's because Kenzo is short. Oh, he's making a short joke. Okay. Okay, lower is better. Lower is better. Not me actually kind of getting into this now. Now that I'm like kind of getting it. Chassis complete level two. Check out the little slots next to the chassis icon. You can fit various parts into these sockets to further improve its performance. You unlock more sockets as you use your chassis and level up. However, no amount of level ups can add sockets to a chassis without any to start with. Wait a second, I always swap my chassis and so I've never leveled up. You can fit suspensions, tires, rims, and all important brakes uh, and more into a chassis. Uh, manual transmissions and nav devices go in your chassis too. Nav devices show you upcoming turns, but they can't they can be damn heavy. Don't rely on you. Don't rely on them. Okay. 
So, hold on. Hold on. Nav. Nav devices. They are heavy. Don't rely on them. Okay, whoa, I thought it only held tires and brakes. Okay, so I'm gonna have to switch out my nav device, which is kind of annoying because that showed me the turns and it made me more comfortable driving. Um, if I, okay, so it shows me upcoming turns, but like I still have the mini map on the bottom left, right? Uh, wait, quickly repeat the basics now that I'm doing it. To become the fastest, you gotta ends and out, blah, blah, blah. Machines complete, got three menus. Engine complete, chassis complete, and body complete. Got it. The performance of your car depends on all three working in harmony. Improving your car isn't exactly straightforward, but basically, want speed, engine complete, cornering. Uh, hold on, gonna write this down, just so I remember. Speed. Engine complete is speed Cor uh, chassis complete is cornering so like turning ie turning and a uh, body complete is just you know like looking cool so does body complete do anything for like anything good for me at all I took a break, you're still in the tutorial? Listen, I knew I knew nothing about cars before I started this, but now not only do I know so much more about cars than I did before, I also know a little bit too much about Final Fantasy. Salty, when are we gonna finish this novel? There are upcoming few upgrades that'll help you save weight and body complete. Chassis, ch chass, chassis, chassis? I don't know what it's called. Note to self, blah, blah, blah. What's my style? GPS is good for beginners, but when you learn the courses, they just add weight. Keep the device uh, for now. And yes, you'll have the mini map if you don't have the GPS installed. Well, then why don't I try it without the... I could try it without the GPS, I think. Body complete just makes you drip down. Okay, so the body complete isn't as important. That's more for like customization, right? That's like if I want to just get dripped out. It doesn't really do anything for like my speed or or like the car itself. You can add body kits and rear wings to increase grip and also reduce car weight to increase your power to weight ratio. Okay. Okay, I think I think I get it. Body complete reduces weight and gives you downforce you fool. Okay. Reduce weight and aerodynamics. Okay. Okay, I think I got it, guys. I think I'm understanding how to car now. Okay. We're done. Buy some parts with the money. Okay, let's do this. Let's do this. Exit. Okay. I think, I think I'm understanding now. It has been 30 minutes since the tutorial started. <laughs> I started that tutorial 30 minutes ago. This is this is very sad. I made a whole cake and we're still in the tutorial. You baked a cake in the span of that tutorial? I didn't know I could increase the stats of my car like a World of Warcraft character. Well, apparently you can. Okay, now that I understand the car, now I can get a little bit spicy with it, okay? Okay, buy unit, buy parts, sell item, machine complete. Okay, so, so what is the unit? Does that mean like a car itself? Oh, no, 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 the unit is the, okay, got it, got it, got it. It's engine unit, chassis unit, body unit. I have, how much yen is that? 100,000 yen? 
Yeah, I can't buy body units right now. These are too expensive for me. However... No, yeah, these are also very expensive. Uh, I can't buy any of these. However, I can buy some parts. Now, how do I earn money in this game? Is that, uh... Is that if I, like, beat people in races I earn money? Or do I have to, like, uh, like do a quest or work a job or something? Uh, I married and had two kids while that tutorial was going on. Excellent. Street pad. Grip handling. Scud. Buy parts only. Try to get new engines and bodies via random encounters. Okay. I didn't know I could do that, so that's good to know. Now, okay, the body parts are very expensive. Oh, except for this. It's a Toon Shop decal. I'm not going to touch that because that doesn't seem like it's going to help me at all. Okay. Aluminum under panel. Uh, FRP hood. I'm going to I'm going to focus on the engine part first. Try to get a muffler like this. But this is it's too expensive. I can't buy it. Um, I mean, I, don't I need a, I need a box air filter, right? Get the part that says 100 cc. Uh, hold on. 100 cc. Where does it say that? Here we go. Uh, I can't buy this. It's too. It's too much money. The filter. I was I was gonna buy the box air filter because I I think I think mine got taken, so I need it. The decals were style points. Also, you can replace it if you lose it, which you can't with the, your BLR sticker. Uh, yeah, I'll, I'm gonna pick up the filter, right? God, I am like I'm struggling. Backseat me, because I need I need a filter because mine was taken in that last race. You can get, uh, at the bank, you can get more cash money, good upgrades on the engine, uh, or blah, blah, blah. You can't get the air filter right now by going to the gas station. Yeah, I'm gonna get the filter for now. I didn't mean to buy the filter twice. <laughs> um, what else can I get? Everything's very expensive. Uh, I can buy tires. Grip handling. Okay, what's the difference between grip and handling? Handling is easier turning, but grip means it's going to slide. So better handling means better turning. Grip means uh, muff. I can't buy the muffler. Look, I can't. I can't buy the muffler right now. It, it's too expensive. Bro, can't you buy parts of the gas gas station? Japan is wild, man. Get the scud. This? I, I was thinking about the Scud. Because the Scud looks good, and I think I can actually afford it. Yeah, I'm gonna buy it. Okay, good. Um, Brake pads. And, yeah, I could, I could get a, a decal, too. Right? That's not that much. It's really the only body part that I can get right now. High comp piston is really good and really cheap. There's a high comp piston. Can I can I buy this? Yeah, well I yeah, I can buy this. Okay, I can buy that. Okay, okay, cool. Yeah, I'm not gonna get the decal right now. Okay. I think that's all I'm gonna get for right now. Um Tune your car and machine complete. Yes, please. I would like to tune it. Okay. I mean, no no wonder my car is so bad. I have, like, nothing... Nothing here. Okay, look look at that chart, huh? Look at that... Look at that blue line going up and the red line going, like, kind of like a little... Little hill. Just like the guy said for it to be, right? Looking good. Looking good. Man, cars are so cool. Kind of like fan Final Fantasy. <laughs> Wish they were real. 
Okay, this we're looking good. We're looking good. Okay, so I don't think I uh, I don't think I bought anything for the chassis. Wait, no, I did I did buy for the chassis. What am I talking about? The scud. Here we go. Um, okay, I'm gonna put the scud on. Now I just need to see what I want to replace with the mini tech. Should I swap out the nav system? I'm thinking about swapping out the nav system because it's it's too heavy, and I don't I don't necessarily think that that's going to be the best. I, f I forget. Would we uh, yeah replace the replace the steering wheel? Ah. Uh... No, I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna swap out the navigating system. See, how is that looking now? How's that looking? Keep the nav for now? Okay, fine, I'll keep the nav. I guess I'll swap out the steering wheel. Suspension damping. What happens if okay, I wanna look at Eh. God, I wish I was that car. <laughs> Replace the wheels with bicycle wheels. Okay, uh, I think that's good for now. But do I have anything for the body at all that I can put on? Or no? Okay, nothing. Nothing for the body. Wait a second, what did it say on the bottom? FF, FR. Wait, how do I change? Okay. It says that my, it, it has, on the bottom left, it says FFFR, MR, RR, 4WD. So, the first two and the last one are highlighted. Does that mean that I have four-wheel drive? I have an engine in the front and I have four-wheel drive, is what it's saying. Um, okay. Yeah, I think it, it, if I'm understanding this correctly, remove the tires, they're slowing your car down. What do you mean, these tires? The Scuds? Or the Flying Saucers? I can't tell if that's a joke or not. That means you can use this body on a FF, FR, or 4W, four-wheel drive car stock. Okay, well, what am I then? How do I check that? Is there like a way? Anyway, wait, where where do I save in the game? Was it at a gas station? I accidentally <laughs> Yes, yeah, save at a gas station. Okay, well, let me I'll have to find the gas station. It's the orange icon. Okay, see ya. Okay, I'm FR, which means Front engine, rear wheels. Wait, isn't that isn't that a more difficult one? Shouldn't I be FF? Is is there a place I could maybe change that? Maybe. Ooh, hold on. I want to check something. It's ideal for drifting. FF is sharp steering, but lower top speed. But didn't, didn't he say that FF is good for, like, people who are just starting out, like, like me? Is this game a car PG? Why, yes it is. If I go to Machine Complete, why is this more complicated than most JRPGs I play? I don't know, man! Okay, so this... Okay, this is an 86 lev body. Okay, so yeah, this is an FR. If I if I change the body of the car, does that mean that I can change what it is, like where the engine is located? Why are we still here? Because I'm trying to make sure I got my car all good. Sometimes, okay. That's all I needed to know. Now let's find the gas station.
Because I don't want to lose any of my parts that I literally just bought. This is just like Persona 5 Royal. Okay. Somebody said it's the orange thing on my map, but I don't see any orange things. What side of the map is the is the gas station, or should I just drive until I find one? Really don't want to get into a race right now. The gas station is where you started. So, like, on the bottom left? I'll just go to the bottom left. Okay. Please don't... Oh, oh, no, 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 Yes, yes, yes. Oh my God. Okay, we're saving. <laughs> Got it. Finally, oh my God, we're playing the game. <laughs> GS mileage, home to BLR second in command, Kyoji Nanba. BLR first formed out of part-timers working at this gas station. Most of us quit, but Kyoji held down the fort. He always said he loved the smell of motor oil. It was a warm summer, covered in grease and sweat. We unzipped our jumpsuits. Look at this grime. We're a real deal racing team, Kyoji said with a smile. Gas station lore. We are, we are reading gas station lore. Me? I couldn't wait to wash it all off with a cold shower. That dank, greasy smell. <sighs> Maybe it started to grow on me. Yo, I heard those night racer guys are looking for Iki. They ain't too happy about getting creamed yesterday. <laughs> creamed? I can't get a hold of Kenzo or Yuka either. Could you real? Could you rally the troops for me? Rally the troops? This is gonna be another circus. What you thinking about? Man, you worry me sometimes. Sir, I came here to save my video game. GS is giving out merch as part of an ad campaign. Enjoy. Ooh, merch? Air filter, green wind get. Ooh, okay, I got I got a new air filter. Don't ever don't ever learn gas station lore at the gas station. <laughs> Whoa, hold up. This is a gas station. Aren't you forgetting something? Save your game. How about a quick GS? Uh, GS? Uh, uh, oh, oh, what? A GS? What is that? Bro, you used to work here. GS is short for game save at a gas. Oh my gosh, I get it. Game save gas station. My God. This is the greatest game of all time. You should fill her up at every gas station you visit. But think of me whenever you do, got it? What does that mean? But think of me whenever you do, got it? He wants me to think of him every time I fuel up my car. This is the most homoerotic gas station I've ever visited. And I'm pretty sure that the sentence that I just said has never existed in the world until I just said it. I mean it. Remember, GS. Uh, I would like to game save. Yes, please. Yo, game save? Game save. A piping hot game save coming right up. This game is wild. Homoerotic homo gas station lore. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to I'm going to save to both slots really quick so that I have a backup. Yes, overwrite this save data.
Okay, let's see the playtime go up. Oh my god. No memory detected. Oh, I don't have a memory card on my slot too. Whoopsies. Yeah, I finished saving my data. GS actually stands for Gay Gay Homosexual Gay. Whenever you get a GS, think of me. <laughs> Every time I save my game, I'm just gonna think of that guy. Okay, we're going to the pet cemetery, right? Or not pet cemetery, what am I talking about? I think it's on the top left of town, somebody said? I could be wrong. I know it was on the outskirts of town, I think. Entry, thank you for your cooperation. What is, what is happening right now? Go back, you didn't clean your windshield. No, I'm not cleaning my fucking windshield. Can I, what is, what is this? What is this place? F's mansion. Why is the camera like this? I don't know. Cars and men kissing? This game was made for me. The high-rise apartment in the front of Kanai Station. It's got some exotic foreign name. He might bite your tongue off trying to pronounce it. Supposedly, it means Moonlight Valley Heights. Iki is the penthouse suite. He's got two things at his crib that I don't have. A water <laughs> and a girlfriend. Not that I have to not that they have time to act all Romeo and Juliet. Iki's a racer, and racers are married to the streets. I'll have to be the one that deals with Kaiseki. <laughs> Sorry, babe. It's like Babe, oh my gosh, can we have sex? Oh my gosh. Sorry, babe, I can't. I'm married to the streets. <sighs> babe, not right now. I'm married to the streets. This game is so... Rem oh my god. Okay, forgot. Uh, random encounters. This game is truly g <laughs> game for gamers. Man, I'm still outmatched by this other car. Warrior unknown. Yeah, I'm gonna lose. Do you think I could just like reset my save if I lose? I think that's okay for me to do. I don't want to be robbed again. Okay. Doing good so far. There's gonna be one turn. The turn's gonna be the left. Yep, here it is. Oh my god. So all that car customization was for nothing. Yeah, all that car customization, for nothing. Oh my god, get out of the way. What? Get out of the way! Oh my god. The street is too fucking narrow. Oh my god. Oh no, guys. Oh no. My PlayStation, it resets. Ah. Oh, dang. Guys, oh my PlayStation. Oh no. Oh, dang, it was like a game ending glitch. And it like, it like broke my PlayStation. I gotta reset it. You gotta get stronger. I, I gotta get stronger. Yeah, guys. Oh my God. Oh, it was like a game. It was like a game breaking bug. And my PlayStation is like, it, it, it broke. I had to reset. I'm sorry, guys. Okay, hold on. I'm going to try out the, the battle mode. To kind of like get my bearings a bit more with the steering. Yeah, I'll play as Kensho. 
And okay. I love how Salty took 45 minutes to fix fix his car up and make it better, and then he immediately loses. Listen, I'm 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 just a guy. I'm just a guy with a dream. Oh no, you better blow on the disc so it won't happen again. <laughs> yeah, let, let me let's just take the disc out of the system. <sighs> okay, we're good. You know how he said, like, you, you have to be, like, married to the streets? I think I'm divorced from the streets. Okay, that's the break. This is gonna be a test ride, okay? It's okay if I lose. Hold on, the game is a little bit loud, so I'm gonna turn it down just a little bit. There we go. Okay. Okay, and... Okay, that is a very hardcore drift. Okay. See, I'm learning, guys. Okay. <laughs> I need to I need to learn how to drift really good. Wow, that is a very sharp drift. The street got my kids in the divorce. Oh my god. Okay, so if I hold down if I hold down the acceleration and press the brake, I can actually turn pretty sharp. Like that. Like oh my god, I think I'm getting it now. Not enough to like actually win, but I'm getting it. You didn't drift in that car? Well, I'm trying my best. Let's just say that. How how do how does one drift? If that's not a drift. The streets are cool, but I miss my wife. I don't want to save my replay data. Uh let's go to the test course course next. Let's do two laps. You can't drift in that car. Oh, well, I'm using the using the wrong car to drift. Front wheel drive cars don't drift so easy, if at all. OK, well, I didn't know that was a front wheel wheel drive car until it would. That was just said to me. Okay, let's try this. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> whoa! No way. Look at that. That was crazy. That was nuts. That was a crazy turn. Still not going to win, but like, you know, what if? Am I right? Oh my God. Oh my God. <laughs> Whoa, oh my god. Turn, turn. Jesus Christ. Control, horrible. Oh my god, turn, turn, you motherfucker. Oh my god. Oh, turn. Oh my god. I mean, I'm, I'm getting some of the turning down now. Okay. 
Okay. Activating brain cells. I win. I won the race. You have to break before turns. Well, I'm 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 learning. It, it, the game has a learning curve. Okay, I'm gonna switch out my car this time. I'm gonna pick a car. I'm gonna pick a car that can actually drift. Well, we'll see how I do better with that. So, which character should I play then? Because I don't think it has... Does it have any stats? Because okay, so that's my car. I just clicked machine complete. Uh, oh, okay, so I, I can load my car data. Oh, okay. Yes, yeah, I would like to load my car data. So, okay, now I can actually, like, test drive my own car. Okay, cool. Yeah. All right, now let's test this out. Let's do two laps. Okay. So now, now I can test drive this car without losing any of my parts. This this game is it, it's really interesting, but I I always fear like I'm I'm gonna do horrible. Okay. I forgot the acceleration. Whoops, that's on me. That's on me, guys. Okay. Focus. Oh my god. You th I, I could still catch up to him. I could still catch up. Man, this game stresses me out. Stresses me the hell out. Oh my god, yeah, let's go! Oh shit. Man, I have a piece of shit car. This is not a good car. I might have to like practice, like, what this game wants me to do. Doing great so far. I mean, I'm still, I'm, I'm in second place. Is the thing. I'm still not doing good. I haven't hit stuff as much, but you know. See? Oh my god. Man, this game is so difficult to get a hang of. All right. Maybe you chose a late game opponent. Um, eh. It's all good, Salty. Being horrible at something is the first step of being sort of good at something. <laughs> wow, thanks. Thanks, guys. Kerchow. Once you get the hang of it, it's pretty fun. I, I don't doubt that. I don't doubt that, but I am struggling. Finish saving replay data.
do two laps of this. So it's okay, Salty. We love to see you fail. Just turning sooner, but also not holding on to the turn for so long. I it's 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 really difficult to get the hang of the timing. Like there there feels like there's almost like a slight input delay on what you're doing with the controller and like what the game does. All right, well, here we go again. No wonder this guy got so ahead of me. Oh my God, oh my God. <laughs> that was sick, that was sick. That was sick. Tell me that wasn't sick. That would that was sick as hell. Eat my dust. Now I can't do that often because there's just there's not really uh, tracks like this that I've been on so far. Oh my god. No, 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 no. Come on, man. Ugh. I think that's when I needed to press brake to like drift a, a, a not drift. I don't know if that's a, a drift or not. Oh. He's right behind me. Um, he's right behind me, isn't he? Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. That is really sad. Well, I did pretty good on the first lap. I'm learning. That moment was very cool. Next time, next time, try throwing a banana peel at him, though. Okay. He's right behind me, collides head into a wall. I love how you can see your rival's headlights behind you, and you are learning. Thank you. Let's try. Let's try out. Um. Let's try out like that last versus, uh, race. And then I think I might be ready again. Oh, this is just one lap. This is a lot of turns though, so I don't know how I'm gonna do on this one. You got a counter steer to make it. Uh, out alive from corners. Left corner with a handbrake means you'll steal hard to the left and then correct once you're exiting the corner. I'm gonna be honest, guys. I really appreciate the tips, uh, but reading out the tips for a game like this, it, it's kind of hard to like visually process if that makes sense. So please do not get upset with me if I don't pull it off even after you tell me. Because it's very difficult for me to visualize what exactly you mean until I, like, get it. You know what I mean? See? That was pretty good, huh? Okay, sharp left turn. Oh. My god. Can I block him? <laughs> oh my god, turn around! Where's- where's reverse? Reverse! Reverse! Is there no reverse? Is there no reverse in this fucking game? Remember, Salty, the harder you press the button, the faster you go. Damn it, I was just starting to understand how to turn. Reverse is triangle. I was pressing triangle, it wasn't working. I might have it like... Might have a faulty thing there, I'll have to check that out. And that was an insanely sharp turn. What? Oh my god. <laughs> Let 
Remember, Salty, driving is just like Final Fantasy. Yeah, when I press triangle, it puts me in a first person view, actually. I'll look at my controls. I haven't been paying attention for at least an hour, but you're able to sh are you able to shoot your opponents in this game? In layman's terms, press the handbrake, then turn hard to the corner and slowly straighten up your car again once you're out of it. Driving techniques are always hard for non-car people. Don't sweat it. Thank you. I appreciate it. Remember, drive on the road. Okay, I'm going to check my options and then I'll go back to the story mode. I love loading. I love when the game loads. Okay, here we go. Option window. Like, don't get me wrong, this game is insanely cool. I just feel like there's a really big skill curve that I'm not necessarily getting. Side break. Yeah, I don't have a reverse. Yeah, there's no reverse button. Use the gear shift to charge your limit breaker. <laughs> Okay, what does passing do then? Shift down below one. Hold on. Reverse is shift down. Oh, okay. When you're in first, you go down, it goes to reverse. Shift down to reverse. Got it. Shift. Okay. Shift down, shift up. Passing. Passing is... Hmm. Okay. Passing is your headlights. You can use it to challenge other racers in the overworld. For reverse, you gotta just shift down. Okay. Shift down. Shift up. I, I was assuming that that was my stick shift. And I actually was trying to figure out what exactly that meant as well. So, okay. So, accelerate, uh, brake, side brake, view. What's the difference between a brake and a side brake then? Because I was using the side brake to, like, drift. Salty shift. Shift down is to reverse, then shift up is to, like, go even faster? Side break is your handbrake. Okay, that I, I was using that correctly. Side break to drift. Got it. Got it. Shift up and down is stick shift. Brake is foot pedal. Side brakes is uh, the rear wheels. Okay. Side brake is handbrake. It locks the rear wheels. Regular brake makes them all break at the same time. Handbrake, drift corner. Brake, grip corner. Okay, so handbrake is to drift. Brake is to grip. Got it. Then, okay, shift down is to reverse. Then shift up is to go super fast and awesome. Maybe? Huh? Huh? The pedal on the right is the accelerator pedal. Yeah, I know. I, I've driven before in real life, okay? I just never got into like a street race. I love everyone talking over the literal translator and giving incorrect instructions. <laughs> Is the translator in the chat? I, I am so sorry. You did such an amazing job translating this and I am just failing so hard. Reading data. Yes, load this save file. Press the gas pedal and the brake pedal at the same time to take a screenshot.
It's okay, this game is a lot. Yeah, I'm I'm struggling. Okay, so okay, that's to turn on my headlights so I can challenge random cars. Can I challenge this bus? No, it just it just honked at me. Okay. Um Okay, let let's find let's find Kensho because he he said that he was at a cemetery. Where the hell would a cemetery be? You can actually challenge the bus in the late game? You can race against the bus? That's awesome! Salty, do you remember the gas station guy? Oh, how can I forget? That's F's mansion. Uh... Yeah, he doesn't want to erase me. Can I challenge just random people to erase? Know what this is? I I can I can challenge random cars to the race N near the gas station. Okay. Oh my gosh! I could. Oh my gosh! I'm gonna destroy this random person. I just flashed a random person on the street and was like, "Hey, you want to get into a race?" And it's like a soccer mom. She's just getting home from like like watching her kids play, and she's like, "Sure, I'll race you." Sounds like fun! Oh my god. Oh, finally, a person on my level! Oh, whoopsies. Not me forgetting that I can drift. That was sad. Straighten out, straighten out. Oh, okay. I'm getting better. I'm getting better. I'm learning. So I can grind out car parts and just like random people. Like people just trying to like drive home after like a long day of work. And I'm like, I challenge you to a race. And I can get like experience points. Okay. This is kind of cool. Oh my gosh, I can take car parts from this random person! Um... Hmm... Brake pads for faster activation. You can also ignore the parts to build up points. Okay, that's what I was gonna ask. So after every race you get RP. RP is then used to take... Uh... To take parts from other cars. Or you could ignore it, not take any parts, and then build up your RP to then get car parts from somebody good later. Okay, I get it. I'm getting it. I'm I'm I'm, under, I'm actually understanding now. Correct. Yes. Okay. Yeah. That, that's pretty cool. I I like that. Okay. So. Honestly, really cool idea for a game. I'm digging this a lot. Now I just need to remember where the gas station was. Okama Stadium. Oh, wait, can I go here for a second? Is this a baseball stadium? You can also exchange RP for cash money at the bank. That is also good to know. That's what I was going to ask. Hey, pal, no hard feelings about tonight. Hard feelings over what? <gasps> you didn't hear? Those crazy-ass Ishikawa brothers kidnapped that shorty on your team. <gasps> what? Yuka? Uh, what the heck's going on? Don't worry. Akira can fix this. Let me hit him up. Shit, he ain't picking up his cell. God damn it, Keisuke. The Night Racers ain't some goddamn Yakuza outfit! You expect me to believe that none of the other Night Racers are in on this? 
Uh, no way! J just listen to me. All hell broke loose in the old chain of command after Akira lost to Iki. The team fell apart, but the rest of us would never stoop this low. This is way too cool. Way, way cooler than it needs to be. Can I trust him? Uh, this doesn't add up. I'll humor. I'm going to humor him. I'm going to humor. I'm a humoring guy. Yeah, sure. Got anything else to tell me? Honestly, man, I'm sorry. I'm torn up about this for real. Hold off. Yesterday was your first street race, right? Pretty slick for a newbie. Hey, what's your name? It's Salt. Salt, huh? I'm Makoto Sawaki. You're going places, bud. I can tell these things. It's like a sixth sense I have. <sighs> Ooh, I'm flattered, but I don't have time to listen to you act all chummy. I know you feel it. That drive pushes guys like us to shatter speed limits. The colors we fly don't matter. We all chase the ultra cool thrills of the red line. We're always looking out for someone faster than us just to taste a new flavor of victory. And heck, even losing is fun too if you can laugh it off with your dumbass friends. It ain't all about grudges or the politics, forget all that. When you race, the rest of the world sinks into a speck in the rear view. <laughs> no way. Am I getting through to you? <laughs> I know you feel me. Uh, thanks for the pep talk, but I like doing things my own way. <laughs> Kiseki drives a night orange grassy. Stay safe out there, I. Is this a dating game? <laughs> no, it's it's cars. I know you feel it. I feel it too. Whenever I go to the gas station. Okay, so I gotta go to this stupid cemetery. Where where's the Stupid gas station. I think it was on the left side. Around here somewhere. I'm just driving around. I'm gonna check this out. Gas station is on the bottom left. <laughs> Get some GS at the gas station. American troops used to bum around here, and Honmaku's been, and Honmaku's been kind of a bad badlands ever since. Just being here gives you an uneasy feeling in your stomach, like your fight or flight instinct was set off. Yeah, also my friend got kidnapped. Uh, my friend apparently was kidnapped. I didn't really react too much to that, but oh my gosh, he's kidnapped. No, stop. Some street racers still felt like roosting here. Here they are battling it out amongst themselves to establish the pecking order. Street racers are just specks of sand in the hourglass, dust in the pages of history. But a time will come, someday, when our names are written on those pages. <laughs> Fuck! I wasn't expecting that. Hey, dipshit, do you know where you're stepping? No, Akira. No, Keisuke. L looks like they're not here. Well, aren't we just rainbows and lollipops? <laughs> you do know about the beef between the Night Racers and the Bay Lagoon Racing, right? You gotta go tell Iki that we want a revenge race, emphasized. An R? <laughs> Why is it shortened? <laughs> a revenge race. No way. Payback? 
Spare me the, the inane theatrics. I can't believe this. They're serious. What a pain in the ass. Hey, we ain't gonna let you prance on back to Candyland. We got a rep to protect. <laughs> race this jump. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'll race this jump. Your team's problems have a squat to do with me. But I ain't scared of you. You're on. Ooh, hoochie mama. <laughs> Course it's on Maku Circuit. Two laps. Let's roll. Hoochie mama. Hoochie mama. <laughs> I had no idea that the person that translated this was so based. Hoochie mama. <laughs> okay, two laughs. My friend is kidnapped. I'm sure I have plenty of time to race. Okay, everyone get out of my way. There we go. getting it now. Get out of my way. Get out of my way. Thank you. Uh oh, I'm losing control. <laughs> okay, better now. <sighs> okay, sharp turn. It's not not there yet. Yes, 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 yes. Oh my god. Oh my god. I'm, I'm freaking cracked. I'm cracked. I'm cracked. I'm clean. Okay. Right turn, right turn. I'm cracked. I'm cracked. I'm cracked. Holy shit. I'm cracked. Okay. Sharp, sharp. Left turn. Oh, oh, no, no. I'm spinning out. I'm spinning out. Oh, no. No, no. Can't be cracked forever. <laughs> Can't be cracked forever, guys. Oh, no. Too much of a left turn. Okay, I can catch up. I can catch up. I can catch up. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. We're good. We're good. We're good. We have another laugh. Lap. I can catch up. Okay. I'm going to have to turn a little bit harder next time. <sighs> okay. Very, very sharp turn coming up. But I have plenty of space to pull it off. Oh my God. Nope. That was bad. Okay, you, you need, oh, you, oh, I only need to come in second? Okay, I can do that. <laughs> I can definitely pull that off. Uh, I don't want to jinx it, but yes. Okay. Sharp turn, sharp turn, sharp turn. Oh my god. Oh, 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 oh my god. Okay, there's another turn coming up. This is the one that I spun out on. Okay. Sharp turn. Okay. Yes. Yes. Oh my God. Go, go, go. Oh my God. Yes. Oh, oh, I feel goaded with the stars. Ooh. Ooh, that was clean. That was clean. Wow. Okay. Holy crap. Okay. I got a lot of RP. That, that was cool. Hoochie Mama, indeed. Okay, I'm gonna keep saving up my R my RP. See, you learned and ego boosted yourself. Thank you, thank you, everyone. Thank you, everyone. Cracked, cracked streamer over here. Okay, now time to go rescue my friend who's been kidnapped. So people said it was on the left side of the map? Hold on. Let me uh, check all of the... Graveyard Street. Okay, the graveyard... Is this it right here? Yes, yes it is. Yes it is. This is the graveyard. What's the name of this game? It's called Racing Lagoon. Your friend has been held hostage for the entire stream. <laughs> yeah, he's been held hostage this whole time. 
Fellas, fellas! I told you already, I, I don't know where he is. You think we buy that? Call Iki and tell him to get his ass over here right now. You know what'll happen if you don't, right? <laughs> you wouldn't want anything to happen to little Miss Yuka. <clears throat> He's in trouble. Help him out, <laughs> not my problem. <laughs> Why do they give me this option? No, I'll help him out. Hey, what's going on here? Ah, salt! <laughs> the animation! Can you take the hint already? I, I don't know where he is. And if you did something to Yuka, you're, you're gonna pay. <laughs> Come on, man. Back me up here. Uh, so what's going on? No time to explain. We gotta book it. At least I'm faster than my feet than Iki is. Do we have to drive? Do we have to like outrun them by driving? Oh my god, yeah, we're driving. We're, we're racing. We're racing. <laughs> the night racers are after you. Shake them off. Okay, this is... who. Okay, around like two, two and a half hours in, I'm actually starting to get this game. Like, I'm starting to get it. So all I have to do is I just have to outrun these guys. Sounds easy enough. Oh wait, I've raced on this track before. This is the one with all those crazy turns. Okay, here we go. Okay, here we go. And then really sharp turn here. Oh, okay. It worked. Whatever. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> this is a blast. Okay, so there should be a very sharp right turn coming up. Not super sharp, but sharp enough. Oh my God. Oh my god, I'm actually getting it. Wow, I'm actually understanding how the game works. This is crazy. Okay. Oh no. Didn't turn well that time. Good news is, I'm still in first, which is pretty good, all things considered. Nice. You know what? I'm going to say it. This game is cool. This game's actually cool. This this game actually rules. Wow. Bad news. Yuka's been kidnapped by those no night racers jerks. They said they'll give her back if Iki accepts Keisuke's challenge. Man, what do we do? So this is really cool. They're using the race replay as a moment for like, like my race replay is the cutscene. That's such a cool idea. Like all of this, this is the text that was happening during the race. This is such a cool idea for like, for like gameplay where like your race replay then becomes the cutscene. That's a really cool idea. I, I don't think I've ever seen a game do that before. That's a really cool idea. Whoa, I can't believe we pulled it off. Time to hit up the party. We'll deal with her later. <laughs> this is going to be sick. I can read that. Why is this game like like actually really cool. <sighs> I think we lost them. Salt, I'll go search around here for Keisuke's car. Okay. If I had to guess, I'd say Ishikawa's are circling around the town. They're going to be hitting all the racer hotspots so they can flex on everybody. 
We gotta get Yuka out of this. I swear it. Wait, isn't that what? Why did that one have like an arrow above it? Why did that car have, have an arrow? Why, why, why does this car have an arrow? Is, is it because it's strong? Can I, can I flash it? Damn tailgaters. You're going to take that from him? Wait, am I? Oh, I'm supposed to be following this, this car? It's them. They're in the car. The guys that I have to find. Whoa, what? That is a cool idea. Gah, asshole punk. Get off of my tail. He's catching up. Does this guy know who he's messing with? Oh, it's a boss fight. Oh, snap. Is that 86 Lev? You know, that little piss ant from Bay Lagoon Racing. Oh my gosh, they have they have uh, the, the girl, the Yuka. They have Yuka in the backseat of the car. They're kidnapping her. Ooh, this will be sweet. Let's dance. They have pink hair and who knows, maybe even pronouns. Stop the Ishikawa brothers and rescue Yuka. I don't think that if I win a street race, they'll just give Yuka back, but OK. It's James and other James from Team Rocket. To protect the world from devastation. To protect the world from devastation. To unite all evils of truth and love. To unite all evils of truth and love. James. James. Oh, I forgot to rub my engine. Whoopsies. Well, Yuka, uh, it was nice knowing you. You're, you're going to be kidnapped permanently now. Wow, th these guys have a way faster car than I do. A sharp turn, sharper turn, sharp turn. Yeah, Yuka's gonna stay kidnapped, I think. Sorry, Yuka, my bad. My bad, Yuka. I couldn't race good enough, and then you stayed kidnapped forever. I am kind of catching up. Focus, focus. Oh my god. What? What's happening? Why, why white screen? Why white screen? What happened? What? Did I die? What happens? <laughs> what? Why white screen? Oh, oh, game over. I, I was, I was too, I was too horrible. Uh, yeah, let me retry. Does, does it let me retry from like where I was just at or am I back at this, the save? It sounds like I'm back at the, the, the save from earlier. Oh no, I'm not, I'm actually not. I come here when I want to get away from it all. About tonight. What Kenzo say again? Okay. What Kenzo say again? Kenzo had the lowdown on the Ishikawa brothers. They're probably cruising around the racer hotspots. I could hit up Johnny's, Chinatown, Bay Lagoon, or even Hon Honmoku. So basically, I just have to drive around until I see them again. Uh, I will save now. It's probably a good idea. Game save. Piping Hot GS coming right up. Don't forget the manual gear shifting is a thing. I don't remember how to do that, so... I'm reading slot one. I'm reading data. Overwriting. So this game has like 10 hours of content. That means that it's going to take me 30 hours to beat it. Finish saving data.
They even have option to repeat story beats so you can catch up on where you where you are after you load a save. Why is this game so good? Wait, is that them right there? That's them right there. Kyoji, Kyoji, stop. Stop. It's the fucking brothers. Hold on. Gotta catch up to them. There they are. There they are. Got him. Salty, you need three legs to drive a manual car. That's really cool that you can actually, like, when you're in dialogue boxes, you can actually see them driving by. Hmm. I can skip the scene. That's useful. Again, I don't know if I'm going to play this game all the way through, but I am starting to really, like, get into it. We'll see how we do on this race. I like that they're constantly driving almost to mock you. Yeah, there's a lot of aspects about this game that are, like, kind of ahead of its time. Ooh, I love this music. Oh my god. And their car is really fast. Do I just have to catch up to them? Is that like what I have to do or do I have to like beat them in the race? Probably beat them in the race, right? The only way that I can beat them is if I'm good at drifting, which I'm not. <laughs> but I mean, interesting that I have to like get good. Okay. Oh, I'm going to lose him again. I lost him again. Damn it. Ah, hey, salt man for the steam cell. What are your favorite? Uh, what are your major recommendations? Also, I love your vids I'm watching since the early. Have you heard about? Oh, thank you, dude. Um, I would recommend for the steam sale. What is there like a big sale going on? I didn't, I didn't even know. In the corners, it's easy to catch up. Have you tried going faster? Okay. So... Now I just have to find them again. Because I just have to drive around until I see them. Whoa! Hold on! That's them! That's them! Those are the guys! There we go. It's really easy to steer into a wall early in this game. It, it's just baby steps on the D-pad. Yeah. Yeah, the fact that there's a scene skip option is crazy. So yeah, I think I just have to like catch up to them. I mean, the good news is, it's not like I'm going to get worse over time. I'm, I'm only going to understand the game more and more. Modern games don't even have that feature. Like, the fact that this game has so many little tiny quality of life things, and it came out in 1999, that's crazy. So what happens when I shift up, when I shift gears? Should I do that when I'm, like, going in a straight line to, like, speed up or something, or... Like, what's the deal with that? Probably good for me to know. I'll finagle with that when I'm on a straightaway. There we go. See that? See that, guys? Here we go. We're on a straightaway. Ooh, got him. 
What's no? Hold on. I I hit them. I, I the only thing that sucks about this game is that like hitting cars will send you back like a thousand yards if you're not careful. Like that's kind of like that does piss me off a bit. Yeah, you see? Dang. Yeah, seriously, they're really fast. But I, I'm really, I'm really starting to get the track, though. The, the track I'm actually starting to, like, memorize. Yeah, I at least touched their car this time. That, that was cool. The fuck? Is this an RPG? Yeah, dude, this is a, this is a car RPG. It is an RPG, but with cars. Yeah, I just need to grind. I need to grind. Well, well, this is the perfect this is the perfect sort of race to like grind out and to like actually learn because it, it gives me the option to like just keep playing it over and over again until I get it. This game goes pretty in depth with the turning stuff as with the tuning stuff as well. For 1999 standards, this game has incredible customization. You can make yourself some pretty insane builds a bit later in the game. I'd recommend trying to upgrade. The game will get harder if you don't. Uh, I'll I, I mean I'll upgrade after I uh, do do this race. Bro, I've never heard of this game, and you, you're convincing me to play it. Yeah, I mean, there's an English translation patch online. Couple of places that you can procure it. I gotta recommend this to my uh, to my buddy Pasty. He'd probably be really into this game. See the yellow. The yellow means very harsh turn. I'm noticing. Okay, how do I speed up now? Because I'm on a straightaway. Oh my god. Oh, come on, man. I was just, I was right there. Oh, I was doing so good, too. But I lost control a little bit at the end. And then make a right, and then drift. Oh, oh, dang. I lost him again. I mean, even when I'm losing, I'm still having a good time. I won't lie. So, yeah, it doesn't seem uh, this race in particular uh, is less of a race and I think more of a chase. Right now, the steam sale, spring sale is going in the 23rd. Dude, p d depending on what's like available, pick up some Sonic games. Those are good. Sonic Generations, um, Battle Block Theater. Uh, what else? You know, like those, those sort of games. I really like those games. Um, Pizza Tower is pretty good. You could pick that up. Dude, you're like super close. You got this. You can win right now, but you have to win at that first sharp turn. The Yakuza games are apparently on a very deep discount, so definitely check those out. People people keep telling me how good the Yakuza games are right now. Like, I, I need to... I actually need to get back to streaming those games. I feel like they'd be, like, right up my alley. Ooh, Celeste is a good one. People really like Celeste. If you like a good, challenging platformer with actually a pretty good story, I've heard. Okay, here we go. So I think I just have to pass them, right? Because it was kind of vague on what I needed to do. 
I think I just need to catch up to them and pass them. Oh my god. Nice. I keep clipping the sides. I can't even see the car anymore. Oh my god. Oh my god. Stop! Please! Catch up to them, Jesus! This game would be a thousand times easier to play if it wasn't so fuzzy. Like, I feel like I have to squint my eyes to, like... Damn. Maybe there's, like, something I can do to make the game a little bit easier to see. Maybe I can, like, change the internal resolution of my totally real PlayStation system. Let me try that. Um... Wow, that is way less crusty. What did I do? What did I do? Look how less crusty that is. Like, I can actually see. Whoa, this is wild. Are you playing on an emulator? No, I'm playing on a totally real PlayStation system. Okay, well, the game is slowing down just a little bit. Hold on. <laughs> I'm playing on a totally real PlayStation system. Come on, guys. I looked away. What did you do? It's so clean. I... I boosted my, my PlayStation system. Apparently, I could have done this the whole time. I think that this game is about to do... is about to feel way better to play. Also, did that... did the taxi, like... Did it move? Did it move past me already? Or they're not in a taxi, they're just in a yellow car. Oh, okay, I'm in a random race. Let, let's see what it looks like now. That was the fastest I've ever seen an HDMI mod done. <laughs> Guys, oh my god, the game looks so much easier for me to see. Wow. Wow, the game looks actually really, really good. Holy crap, I can see! I can see! I can fight! I can actually see the turns? Oh my god. It's a little bit jank, like there's some like a... Uh, Pixels fumbling up like farther ahead, but it's fine. It works. And all of a sudden, I just got really good at drifting. It's like getting glasses for the first time. It's definitely not made for this resolution, but, you know, we can make an exception, right? Okay, I lost, but I actually have a really, really good way of actually uh, circumventing the loss. <laughs> But yeah, holy shit, I could have changed that setting the whole time.
Very good idea for me. I'm a cheater? No, I'm not a cheater. I'm a- I'm a racer. I'm married to these streets! Okay, here we go. Continue. Okay, reading slot one. Yes. Uh, I'm gonna try to race these guys two more times. Before I uh, end up ending stream. I thought that you and the streets got a divorce. Nah, me either. Wait, there they are right now. No, 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 gas station guy, move. They're going down that street. Where do they go? Where do they go? You think they're still going down the street? Probably not. Oh my god. They're, it's them. It's them. No! Fuck! What the hell? Ah. Oh. Ah. Oh. Come on. Okay, I can definitely outspeed this person, but still. Oh my god. That was real. Wow. What? A, what? Oh, and I, I've been on this track before. Wait, why is this guy faster than me? I have more everything than him. My steering is better. I'm better. God, play, playing this with like... A higher resolution is so much easier on my eyes. Okay, I better not lose this race. I've never been more set up for victory in my life. If I botch this, I, I need to, like, die. Look, I'm default. I'm faster by default. Oh my god. Oh my god. Cracked? Cracked turning? Okay, now it's just a very sharp turn. Uh, uh, there we go. There, I win. Give me your RP. I want more story content. I, I want a race to know more about what this story is. No, I'm not going to take anything from you. No, no, I... Back, yes. <sighs> I want less story content. No, I need to know where this story goes. Okay, well, the bad news is uh, I've lost the car that I was tailing. Which, you know, that sucks. This is the type of game that I would love to just play off stream and just like kind of grind at. I could probably grind pretty good on this. That car probably like the car that I'm tailing probably does like a big loop, right? Probably has like a preset uh, destination that it goes to every time. But yeah, if I grind on my own, I could probably, like, grind out some money. In between, like, editing, maybe. Whoopsies. Oh my god. Please don't, don't get in another race, please. Oh my god. I want to race the the I want to race the twins. Where are the twins? Maybe if I go back to the bottom left, they'll probably be around there. They're usually around the gas station. I could save now. What's up? 
Game save. Wait, what's happening right now? Oh, okay. There we go. Reading slot one. Reading data. All right, save data. Yes. Also, the higher resolution might be making the emulator chug a little bit. If if I see it slowing down too much, then I'll just I'll just lower it a little bit. Actually, might try that now. Settings. Hmm. Let's try that. It's a little bit lower resolution, but it should make the game run a little bit faster. Actually, no, it runs the same amount. I'll just, I'll up it again. Uh, what's up? Is it just me or is the text like really slow in this section of the game? Is that a person walking on the top? You guys see that? That person, there's a person on the sidewalk there. On like, and like near the middle of the screen. Oh yeah, there's multiple people walking on the sidewalks. Can I run them over? Oh, 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 oh. Okay, let's let's get them. Let's get their asses. I'm here to save my girlfriend through the power of race. Through the power of racism. It's not a thing about it's not like real races. It's like I like racing. That's the thing. That's the joke. You get it? I hope you guys are ready. I'm going to fail again. Okay, I gotta catch up to them with the turns. That or I need to grind out upgrades so that I can match them in speed. I'm gonna kill myself. I'm gonna, I'm gonna end it. I'm gonna end it. We're too far apart. It's gonna fade to wait any second now. Yep, there we go. Fade to wait. Uh, okay, one more try against these guys before I end. This is a very, this is very hard. Very hard to get. Oh my god. Oh, there they are, there they are. No, hold on, hold on. There we go. Okay, last one before I end the stream. Let's hope. I will get them. 
let's 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 do it. Let's get it. Last one for the night. Let's make it good. I streamed this like way longer than I meant to. Okay. You got your money on me? Oh, you're going to lose that money. Okay, and left turn. Left turn. Right turn. Oh my god. Well, it's over. It's over. Good try, guys. Good try. It's over. Oh well. If you bet on me, you just lost all your money, folks. Or did you? Because I am catching up. Oh my god, I'm gonna kill myself. I'm gonna kill myself. Okay, I need to do one more. That that was that was actual bullshit. That was actual horseshit. Bruh. Ugh. Okay, I'm gonna... Did I get them? Did I get them or did I get the other ones? I hope I got the right one. I, I did get the right one. Spends half an hour in tutorials, refuses to upgrade any of the systems it taught him. Based. Doesn't matter if I win or lose, watching you play a technical car game has made my day. Thanks, Alex. <sighs> Salty suicide arc. Okay, all right. I got it, I got it. All right. Turn coming up. Turn. Turn. Drift. Turn. Got it. All right, let's go. Okay. Again, why do I keep hitting the fucking car? Why do I keep hitting it? Get out of the way! Oh my god. I, I might as well just stop. I might as well just stop the car. There's no point. Oh my god. Oh my god! Bruh. Bruh. The, the worst thing about this game that I'm learning is the physics when you hit another car. When you hit another car in this game, it like stops all of your momentum for some reason okay hold on hold on hold on i i think i got it i think i got it i think i actually i i get it i get it your car is lighter which means you can go through uh, corners faster you just need more power though okay all right <laughs> i'm gonna race this guy and then i'm gonna quit <laughs>
<laughs> I, I tried. Yeah, the collision in this game sucks. It takes so much. So I'm my car is really good at turning corners like I can. I do corners really well. My main speed is just not really that good for some reason, and I don't know why. And I, I'm going to have to, like, figure it out. Yeah, you see, I'm, like, much slower. My base speed is, like, much slower. But my turning's pretty good. Like, all things considered. See, like, I'm pretty good with turning. Now, the problem is straightaways. You would think that, like, now that I'm, like, perfectly still, I could speed up. I'm not speeding up. Can you... Can you slow down, please? Is that possible? Oh my fucking god. Fuck you. Screw you. Didn't happen. Didn't happen. Didn't exist. <sighs> okay. Um... Check the tune shop after the race. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna do that, but I'm gonna I'm gonna uh, do a little flip and uh, oh, I hit I hit the the PlayStation. Damn it, I hit the PlayStation, guys, and then it reset. Fuck. Oh man, I hate when that happens. I did a really cool backflip and then I I bumped into the PlayStation and it reset. Guys, I'm sorry. My bad. That's my bad, guys. Sorry about that. You have low acceleration. You need more power. Okay. I'll see if I can visit the tune shop then. I'll, I'll see if I can tune it up. I just got to remember where the tune shop is actually located. Is friend lock still happening? Yeah, dude, it's tomorrow. Guys, before you ask, is this stream still happening? You can always just check the live tab. I have them scheduled a lot of the time. I might not have them scheduled right away, but like I have friend lock scheduled for tomorrow. Uh, be careful out there. Okay, where is the tune up shop? Because I have a lot of RP. Actually, I could probably... I should stop by the bank first, right? Okay, I'm not racing here right now. Where is the bank? This is probably not the bank at all. Oh, here's a bank. No need to go to the bank. The The shop is where the racetrack is at the top. But wh why don't I... Shouldn't I exchange my RP for money so that I can go to the tuning shop and then buy new things? Kenzo told me to come here if I was ever in a tough spot. Never hurts to have some cash tucked away in a rainy day. Counting pennies is a drag, but running out of dough is worse. Not that it'll happen to me, of course. Welcome to Wakaba Bank, the secret vault of the night. Our midnight services are as follows. Uh, okay, RP, RP trade. Oh, and you can put RP in the bank? Rewards points can be traded for yen at a unique uh, rate to the customer. The minimum trade amount is 1,000 RP. The next trade rate is 1 RP equals 75 yen. Okay. How much RP do I have? Okay.
like 5,000 RP. That work? Yeah, why the heck is this guy built like this? Like, look at this. Dude, what is his abdomen? Where, where does his legs start and his abdomen end? I can't quite put it together. He's built different. This man is... <laughs> this man is built like Gru from Despicable Me. <laughs> Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna trade in five thousand RP. Okay. Okay, that's that's a good amount of yen. So if I lose a race, I'll I I lose like reward points too, right? That's why it's like you can you can store RP here too. I keep accidentally entering the same places. I, I did not mean to enter the bank again. Welcome to Wakaba Bank, the vault of the night. Later. Grew if he wasn't based. You also lose your parts. So I lose parts if I lose a, a random race. Uh, and I also lose... What's it called? Whatever, whatever, whatever. I get it. Is some somebody said that uh, what I'm looking for is top left. So that's the ballpark. This is F's mansion. I'm gonna have to memorize this map at some point. Just drove in a circle, but don't, uh, don't mind. Don't mind me. That's the bank. Stadium Street. Johnny's Motomachi. What is Motomachi? Oh my gosh, it's, it's a Johnny's restaurant. Don't they have those in Japan? They're, they're called like, they're literally called like Jonathan's. The harsh lights of the city fade away. It's a warm smile shines through the neon soaked reflections of your windshield. We all gotta unwind sometime. When we need to chill, we roll up to this joint. Johnny's. It's where the street racers hang. Yeah, I think Johnny's is a real chain. I think it's called Jonathan's in real life, but Johnny's is like, I think, a parody of it. They serve basic ass coffee and basic ass grub. <laughs> But it's always filled with racers who want to trade stories and shoot the shit. We all speed through the same night. It's the only thing that binds us. Things have a habit of working themselves out if you drop by. The warmth of this place gets through to you even after the coffee has gone cold. Johnny's. There's a bit of magic here. Was that just like a commercial read? Did they make me do a commercial read for this? Welcome to Johnny's! Hey, you're the new guy in the Bay Lagoon Racing, right? I heard that your girlfriend got kidnapped. Anyway, do you want hash browns or something? This place has been buzzing about it all night. Look, I need to know if you've seen any night racers here tonight. Whoa, you need to relax. The only night boy who's been here tonight is Makoto. But he left pretty quick. Cause it's that one girl's day off, you know? They're not here. Uh, yeah, I'll order something. Can I, can I order something? What is happening? Talk of last night's race was swirling around table to table. Last night wasn't some crazy dream. Tales of the legend coming to life were spreading at the speed of sound. What is that guy doing with his arm in the back? Is he talk? Is is that his talking animation? You know, just normal person like like talking, arm twitching. Oh my gosh! Wait, if you look closely, his arm is just like coming off of the socket. 
it's like it's a it's like above his shoulder like the joint is just not it's not connecting so basically i was finna jerking it like this and that that's what i tells him i tells him i say i say i'm gonna jerk you off at the speed of sound and then i do this And I'm gonna ride this sucker until the end. <laughs> Dude is built like a Roblox character. It's it's insane. Okay, uh back to searching. Uh, China Street, Chinatown. Okay, I, I keep forgetting where the stupid tune-up shop is. I'll find it eventually. It's definitely over here. This is the body shop. Need the tune-up shop. Marine tower. Um, running out of places to go. I, I've gone to pretty much every dot. Ancient bay, not what I want. It's a place with the thingies and what's its. It wasn't it near the Ferris wheel. Uh, I could go back to the Ferris wheel. Because the Ferris wheel is over here, yeah. Kava Bank. It was down here. Oh, it's the tune shop. There we go. Remember when Salty said one race and the stream ends? Listen, I say a lot of things. I say so many things. Toon Shop Spencer. Toon Shop Tutorial. Let's go Toon Shop Tutorial. Okay, I need something to boost my power. So... Maybe a unit? Do I have enough for a unit? Probably not. Yeah, I still don't have enough for a unit. Sigh! I guess we can just go to uh, the parts then. Uh, ooh, up to plus 3% power via intake efficiency. Well, no, I already have that actually. Plus 8% power at mid RPM. Uh, yeah, somebody, somebody said, somebody said to get a muffler a little bit ago. I, is this, yeah, this is a muffler, it's the Aerojet. Uh, bore up. So yeah, I'll get, I'll get the funny muffler. Yeah, buy the part. And then this this would help too, right? Because it's plus eight percent power. Um get bore up. Uh if it gets you the most parts in this store. Bore up. Up to 100 cc higher bore. <laughs> Torque via higher displacement. What is it what does it do? What does that mean? Up to 100 cc higher bore. It gets you the most parts in this store. Makes the engine go faster? Oh, don't have to tell me twice. Okay, let's attach the funny muffler. Okay. Okay, okay. What should I replace then? Should I replace the high cop or the power intake? 
for the boar up. I'm thinking high comp. I think. Replace the filter. Okay, I'll replace the filter. Wait, I need to see what is the difference. Okay, it, it does boost up a little bit. Filter. The filter gets very little power. Okay. Okay. I think that that's good, right? Much better than last time. Nothing I could swap out. Uh, remove the GPS. Uh, I'm thinking about removing the GPS. I might just change it to the Route 36. Like, I could get the GPS again if I want to, but I, I think I think it'd be better without the GPS because the GPS is like... It, it's, it's heavy. You can sell the parts. Uh, I'll sell the parts when I get later in the game because I don't want to sell parts right now. Because what if I like get like totally screwed over? I think that that's good. Yeah, I really don't use the GPS, so that's fine. I mean, I kind of use the GPS. I won't lie. We'll, we'll, we'll see how I do without it. We'll see how we do without it, but I, I think I think I kind of get it, so. Worst comes to worst, I just I just go back and I, I change it again. Let's go to that gas station to save. Trying my best not to get into any road fights. There we go. I'm actually starting to learn where stuff is. Let's save. I've driven into the gas station itself. Piping hot game save coming right up. I'm kind of tempted. I kind of want to do the do the race again. The only problem I have with this game is that some of the menu navigation isn't really that fast. The loading is very long, but you know, there's not much you can do with, with like a PS1 game in that regard. Yeah, I'll finish saving my game. Yeah, let me see if uh if I can locate this their uh their car again. It it frequently drives past this gas station, so I think if I chill here oh my god, speak of the fucking devil. Get over here. Wait, I thought this was a PS2 game. No, this is a PlayStation 1 game. This is for PS1. Okay, let's see. Let's see if my new parts actually like help. They probably don't. If I catch him, I will eat my hat. If if I if I do another stream of this, I'm definitely gonna be save stating boss fights like this. I'll have to figure out how to do that. And then right here and then hard drift. Ah, I messed up. Well, so much for that. If don't you mean when? Yeah, I'll 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 stream it again sometime. 
I just want to finish up Luigi's Mansion and uh, Kirby first. Want to get those under my belt? Oh my God! I feel like I'm slower now. I might be insane, but it feels like I'm slower. It feels like I'm slower. I, I don't I don't know. That that didn't really help as much as I thought it did. I think if you hadn't messed up, you would have caught up. Uh, I could I could try. Do you think the parts made you heavier? I mean, it would be really helpful if I had like somebody on Discord to like tell me what to do. Okay, one more time. I'm not addicted to this. I'm not addicted at all. Why are you saying I'm addicted? I'm not addicted. I just think that racing is super cool and super fun and super awesome. And the- Oh my god! My god! Ah! Ah! Oh my god, I'm severely outmatched. Well, actually, no. No, I'm not, because their weight is like- they have a really, really, a, a lot of weight. They're probably going to be slower. This is my last race for the night. Let's, let's see how this goes. Yes, I knew it. They're slow. They're slower than me. They're slower than me. They, they they won't be able to beat me. Is this a, a right right turn? Oh my god. They're gonna beat me. They're they're gonna beat I I'm gonna throw my controller at the wall. I'm going to throw my controller at the wall. They're gonna beat me. Oh my god. Stream over. <laughs> Stream over. Stream over. <laughs> Goodbye. I can't do that. No way. No way in hell. Okay. That that is that is that is my cue. That is my cue. I'm done. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. Friend lock tomorrow. So if you want to stop by and check out the new uh, friend lock stream, it'll be on YouTube tomorrow. So yeah, the game is really cool. Too bad I. Freaking suck at it. Oh my god. Anyway, bye everyone. Have a good night.